Thanks, Nicola. I'm going to do it fast because it has been a, a long day. Palika, for those people who are watching the streaming service, we, we, I just checked there are over 600 people watching, and even in Sweden, which is now at least 1030, they are still be entertained by our capital markets day. I hope um, you got what we, we achieved, what we wanted to achieve with this day, to tell you a bit about uh, where we are. And um, I think the three key messages we wanted to communicate to you have been repetitively communicated by me, Tim, in his presentation. Uh, targets are on track. We are much more confident, obviously, that we can do it because we are now 18 months into the execution. No major changes there, so this is uh, positive. Una, I think, uh, we, we illustrated a bit, is a great opportunity for us in terms of growth. Don't get too much focus on the EBITDA margin, which will go up, I'm pretty sure, as well in the near future. But it's a fantastic uh, growth business. And again, even more important for me as, um, as, as to see a kind of long-term business and um, kind of a sustainable business, that the um, digital lifestyle strategy we rolled out is working, and that we see first proof of performances when it comes to uh, the APU, when it comes to the churn. Um, that bundling value-added services going to value instead of price is uh, the right way to go. So um, overall, the company, as I, got, as I said, is in a much better shape. And for me, you know, when Christina Stemig, my chairwoman, who is uh, in the audience as well, asked me probably two years ago if I would take over the, the helm of, um, of Millicom, I knew, and we knew it well, it's a kind of transformation. We have to change the business quite radically. We want to move it forward, be entrepreneurial, and uh, fix all the kind of things we had to fix and uh, complete the turnaround. And today you can really see in sense, this is done. I mean, we, we fixed the main issues. Now it's all about execution, uh, moving the business forward, and just deliver on the plans and the ideas and, and the ambitions we have been creating. And uh, that was the other key point for me to, to make clear to you uh, as our investors and our shareholders and our, our stakeholders. There are very good talent people in the company nowadays who do it. It's not me uh, at all anymore. It's the executive team. You have seen lots of them. You have seen the level below, for example, in the panel discussion, or you have seen with uh, Esteban what kind of quality we have in terms of GMs in the, in the countries. And that should give you, I think, a lot of confidence um, going forward in the business. Let me finalize then maybe the, the, the whole day with uh, which I believe, from my experience as, as an executive in this year, what is the most important point, or mo the most important factor to make a company successful? And I had a long lunch with uh, one of my, my, my prime examples I always look up when it comes to running uh, innovative new business, which is Reed Hastings, the CEO and founder of, uh, of Netflix. And over the lunch, we agreed that uh, the real backbone of being successful in a business is the culture of a company. If you have a strong culture, if you have a very unique culture, you create normally a very strong business. And trust me, when you see mediocre cultures uh, and mediocre companies, you get normally mediocre results. So we put a lot of effort into the culture of, uh, of Millicom, and we put a lot of effort to communicate this culture and try to attract people and talent around this kind of culture, which go in sync. And it's a very simple culture we have. It's uh, based in three words. We always say we stretch for more as we think is possible, which, or we demand more from ourselves, as you can see on the um, ambitious targets we have been uh, setting out. We work very hard and very fast, faster than the competition. Speed is normally the kind of key essence for us to uh, deliver the business. And if everything goes fine, we have a huge party and celebrate our victories uh, in, uh, in the company. And just to give you then the glimpse how we communicate internally, I end this day with, uh, with, uh, with uh, another video, uh, which we produced not for this Capital Markets Day, which we produced internally which is a military commander concept, where we said to our employees, look, we have this philosophy, we have this culture. If we, do, if we achieve our targets, uh, in terms of uh, the nine billion in particular, we have achieved something outstanding uh, as, uh, as a group, as a team. And uh, in case that happens, somebody of our employees will have a very special journey. So watch the military commander movie, and uh, thanks for the day. <laughs>